Hello guys, this is Oxman bringing you yet another scripting and editing video for Armour 2. Um, what I'm going to do here is basically show you how to put pictures in the game and in the briefing. However, I was not able to get a intro start um, picture because that is has to do with resources and all that and um, I haven't figured it out yet but still I'll uh, start with this uh, first of all I got my briefing um, right now I have a beer JPEG file that's this beer and, and a beer to PAA which I'll come into later and in it of course runs the briefing the briefing itself is this one so just creates a note if you've seen my briefing video you should know what this is and it adds this image image PA JPEG so you'll have to have the JPEG file the picture file in the um, mission folder uh, or you know yeah well, what else you need to note is that the picture always has to be double. So if we say 512 and 256, I believe that's the one I use right now. The width, uh, the uh, the length of the picture needs to be 512 or double the height. So you always have uh, times two. Uh, so if you need, if we want to do a hundred you need to have two hundred uh, I believe that's the case that's what I've been reading but still uh, my picture now is five five twelve and uh, two fifty six so that's uh, my picture that's the JPEG file like this one um, I believe that's all you need I'll come go more into detail how to get a PAA file uh, right now Right, so this is a uh, texture viewer. This is what BIS made themselves to uh, edit the PA files. What I've done here is I've saved my picture here from Photoshop. I have a save as, and then I put list up Targa TGA. Uh, if you don't find anything, if you don't have Photoshop, just Google JPEG to TGA. Because from TGA you can put in here, you can open it, a TGA file, that's a TGA, and then you can save it as a PAA there. So that's all you need. Uh, right now, I'm just gonna go right to it um, and see how this looks in game. Right, so uh, I have three different info boards here. I've added this set object texture zero and brackets and they quote unquote this this is basically a flag you can find these uh, lying about somewhere I think there's forums where you can find all the different flags and all that but what I want to do is this this is my own picture the PAA file which I've made basically made myself and uh, this one too by the way how to do intros has to do something with resource I believe this is stuff that um, in theory puts a layer in front of your player's vision uh, either on top or behind uh, obviously on top then and it fades away later but um, that base that's basically what you do you make I believe you make a class for your type of picture and then you use it right like that uh, I'm not sure though. I have not learned how to use these kinds of things yet. However, I do know the normal pictures in briefings and in games, so let's see how that looks. Right, so we have our lovely little beer here. And that one. So, beautiful. And these are the flags. The briefing. And this is how it looks. Right now I'm using a quite a large picture, 512, 256, but um, yeah, that's all you need to, you know, <laughs> that's all you need to, you know, uh, that's all you need to know for using briefing pictures and pictures 
like on the walls and stuff you can just set the texture I believe it's mostly used for like doing maps of some kind or like pointers or you know anything that you want to show in the game um, if not just show this because this is beautiful anyway um, uh, that's all you need to know uh, if you need more help anything at all just uh, ask away in the comments below please do like this video um, also subscribe to my channel uh, I'll be posting lots of more editing uh, tutorials as well as you know gameplay from lots of other games um, thanks for me